welcome to our vlog today. What are we doing? Today is Brianna's luncheon. Her daughter, the one that went to Puerto Rico and turned 14, is her luncheon. Do you remember your eighth grade luncheon? Oh my gosh, I do. Do you remember it? Yeah, I remember mine. Oh my god. Oh yeah, Arch is at the Lido too in Chicago. What did I wear? I wore this like pink dress with like these sparkly flowers on it and these sparkly white stockings. What'd you wear? Uh, I wore a cream, like from ivory colored satin long gown, like I was uh, in Harlem Nights. <laughs> with my hair slicked down. I remember that. I remember that. Nothing dress. like how Brianna looks. Oh yeah, Brianna looks so stunning. But times have changed and times are different now. And the style is different. She just looks so beautiful. And yeah, say Renee, you did a good job. Thank you. You did as well by you helping did a really good and being there. Really appreciate you guys, my family, everybody chipping in to help out with Brianna all the time. Aww, don't but mention so it. Don't mention it. It's totally fine. fine. Yeah, but it makes being a single mother easy. Try to, yeah, for all my younger subbies out there, try to wait until you're married before you start having children and all that stuff. Renee did a really good job. She did it by herself. She did a really good job. And Brianna's an awesome kid. And she's amazing. And she looks amazing. I'm, I'm kind of slightly jealous how cute she looks. Because I didn't look like that. It ain't great. I'm sure, you're gonna so, borrow that dress. I'm gonna borrow that dress. Yes, I am. Because it's like super cute. If I can fit it or get into it, but it is super I'm cute. Sure. It's like an all purpose dress, too. Yeah. Comment below and let me know what it is that you wore on your eighth grade luncheon. Because, you know, like luncheons, graduations, proms, quince, quinceañeras, all that stuff. That stuff is it's really big, it's a big deal. To, uh, young girls and it's a rite of passage and I want to know did you like your outfit did you absolutely hate your outfit and we'll let you know where we got everything from so if you wanted to recreate the look for a little one of your own or maybe even yourself you can go and uh go do that okay so we're right outside of St. Malachi for the ribbon pinning for Brianna we actually made it here in time I'm hoping so let's go inside and watch this happen I'm so excited for her my baby is growing up Yesterday she was just being brought home and now she's freaking going to high school, dude. Where has the time gone? So, I mean, if you have any nieces or nephews or children, it's true what they say, man. Just appreciate every moment with them because it really, really does fly by. She's like, she's blossoming like a beautiful little flower.
y'all. We're gonna have to talk him into bringing me on a romantic date. I don't ask for much, but um, I think I'm really digging this. The skyline is so pretty, and it's not even sunny outside. It's just really pretty, and the, the lake is sparkling. It's really cool. Chicago also has this thing where they do the um, fireworks every weekend, or maybe three times a week or something like that. And could you imagine, like, at nighttime when this is lit up really pretty and fireworks going up? It's probably super cool. He's gonna need to take me. I shouldn't have come on this lunch in with Brianna because now I'm gonna be a spoiled brat and always want to come on these dinner cruises. Antonio, I, I just met these beautiful young women on a boat. She trying to, she trying to get my son to be her son-in-law. But this was an amazing time. It was, it was really fun. It was beautiful. I had the best time. The best time. I the, the food, the food was horrible. The rice, the rice was hard. 
<laughs> they said the macaroni is supposed to be like a three or four the cheese. The macaroni soggy, the pizza, mush, and the chicken taste like Say it again. <laughs> Say it again. <laughs> The the macaroni again. soggy, the peas all mushed, and the chicken tastes like wood. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm too young for all that. <laughs>